Hello, welcome to the Super Data Science YouTube channel. If you find this video useful, don't forget to subscribe, like and share the video. Today we're going to be looking at the by function. Now this is great if you need to aggregate some data on a different level. So today we're going to be using the MT cars data set. So first of all, we'll just define our cars data as equal to MT cars. Now this is a data set which is already loaded into R. So if we run it here, we can see that we've got for each different car type on the side, we've got a few different columns. So the first thing we're going to try and do is summarize the miles per gallon for each number of cylinders. So to do that, we need to do by open brackets cars underscore data and that's miles per gallon. Now this is the, this is the data that we want to summarize. So we want to summarize the miles per gallon column. And what we want to do is do this by the cylinder. And what we want to get is the summary for each of these combinations. So here we can see for each cylinder type of 4, 6 and 8, we've got the min, first quartile, median, mean, third quartile and max for the miles per gallon. Now, if we want to find the max horsepower for each number of gears, we use a very similar code to what we did before. So we use cars underscore data, and this time we want to summarize the horsepower, and we want to summarize that by the gears. But this time we want to know the maximum. So in our function, we put max. So here we can see for our three different gear types, we've got the max horsepower. Now let's do something a little bit more complicated and let's summarize by two variables. So now we're going to summarize the mean displacement for each combination of transmission type and B slash S. So we have by and the data we want to summarize is our displacement. And we, this time we want to summarize it by two variables. So we use C to concatenate, and we want to do it by VS and AN. And this time we want to get the mean. So if we run this, we can see we've got it for each combination. So 0, 0, 1, 0, 0, 1, and 1, 1. And here we can see our mean displacement. Now if we want to calculate our summary of two different columns by two different groups, we can do that as well. So let's summarize the mean displacement and the mean WT for each transmission type and VS. So by cars underscore data, and again we're going to use C to concatenate because we want our displacement and WT. And we want to do this again by the same columns that we had before. So we do C, VS, comma, AM. And this time we're going to do the summary. So our function argument is just summary. And if we run that, we can see we've got our four different combinations. 0, 0, 1, 0, 0, 1, and 1, 1. But this time we've got the summary for our two different columns. So we've got the minimum for our column disp and the minimum for our column wt. So the by function is a great way to summarize data into different groups and you can do that for lots of different functions. I hope you all found the video really useful. If you've got any questions or comments, please remember to comment below and don't forget to share, like and subscribe to the channel.